It's no secret that insurance companies have bailed on homeowners living in the mountains because the fire risk is too high, they say. State government is now experiencing that same frustration. Fox 26 reporter Rich Rodriguez explains why Cal Fire struck out trying to get fire insurance for a fire station. Cal Fire operates the Ishii Conservation Camp in the foothills of Tehama County. It's roughly 325 miles north of Fresno. Inmates at the camp learn firefighting skills, then provide fire protection to four counties in the region. Recently, a Senate Budget Committee learned that an $11 million project to replace the kitchen at Ishii Conservation Camp stalled because fire insurance couldn't be obtained. They weren't interested in selling insurance policies in the region due to the, fire, the perceived fire risk in the area. Cal Fire turned to Fair Plan, a state program that all California property owners have access to use. Since the project is being paid with bond money, Fair Plan couldn't provide sufficient coverage to meet the requirements of the bond underwriters. It really daylights the fact that how messed up California is, where we have a fire station that's going to house firefighters and train them, and we can't get fire insurance for it. That's how bizarre California is right now. So how does the kitchen project continue? The cost adds to the budget deficit. So when this happens, we swap the project over to cash funding, in this case, general fund, as we're unable to, to sell the bonds and get the, the debt uh, financing. After the hearing, Senator Dolly heard from insurance companies who say they might be able to help California. So I'm going to put them in contact with the Department of General Services and see if we can't come up with a product that is able to uh, suffice what we need to do to get the bonds uh, moving and we can get these uh, firehouses needed. We need these firehouses to protect our communities. It's not just the private sector experiencing the wildfire insurance crisis. Cal Fire now understands how it feels to be rejected by insurance companies. Rich Rodriguez, Fox 26 News. There are other Cal Fire projects that may have difficulty getting fire insurance as well. And with that, for our question of the day, we'd like to know, do you think it's fair for insurance companies to say no to insuring fire stations? Chime in with your answer on our website. All you have to do is search KMPH.com or scan this QR code on your screen. Hi, I'm Monty Torres with Fox 26 News on YouTube. Thank you for checking out our YouTube channel, where we have loads of great content for you to choose from. And while you're here, why not click on the subscribe button right here? That way you can stay in touch with all the latest breaking news, everything news related within the Central Valley. And thank you for watching.